Let's move in silence, so I'm tiptoeing So keep blowing, I got it locked up like Lindsay Lohan Put it on my life, baby I'ma make it feel right, baby Can't promise tomorrow, but I promise tonight Die. Excuse me, excuse me And I might drink a little more than I should tonight And I might take you home with me if I could This is another episode of Minecraft Gameplay, and today I'm going to be showing you um, a new, uh, completely new world. Uh, it's in my games folder here. Um, Minecraft. Yeah, so I'm going to show you a completely new world. Uh, should you know, should you want to know how how to make the world and how you know how to get started? But I'm also going to show you how to make a mine because mines are pretty good, and you can find um, you can find some pretty good resources. I'm going to trouble my keyboard here and just. Just doesn't seem to be starting up properly. There we go. Alright, so I'll just wait for this to start up here. Enlarge this a bit. Okay, so I'm gonna start a new single player. I'm just gonna make a new world. I'm gonna call this um I'm just gonna call it getting started. Uh, I'm not gonna bother with a seed, so it'd just be random world. Uh, I'm gonna create a level. So should you experience any lag, um, it's probably because I don't have very high specs on my computer, so sorry if you do get a bit of a lag there. Um, right, so I need to make sure that my video settings are quite low due to this. Right, so let's get all, um, so let's get started. First, you'll probably need some um, some wood because wood's quite valuable during the first stages so I'm just going to go all the way to the top of here because there's bound to be some trees somewhere here we go, these are some trees they're some funny looking trees but um, that's what they look like so just take some wood off here Depends um, how much, how big you want your thing. How, however big you want to make your mine, you'll need a lot of wood because the wood's not just made to make um, to make like uh, pickaxes. It's also made to make torches and sticks. There's there's a various amount of things that wood can be made from. So you need you definitely need wood. In other words, you need a lot of it actually. So I'm gonna get about. Um, about 20, 20 pieces of wood, um, it goes pretty high, these are some quite high trees. Okay, I think, I think 12 will do. So then you'll probably want to make, find some, like a bottom of a hill or something, but it doesn't really matter, but it's best if you've got a bit of open space. Um, so I think this here will do perfectly. So first, I'm gonna craft. Um, actually, I don't want to do that. I wanna get some uh, wooden planks. So to craft that, it's just one wood, and it makes the wooden planks for you there. And then four individual wooden planks there make a crafting table to craft all the stuff. So I'm gonna put a crafting table right here, and then I'm gonna make some. Um, make eight sticks. And then with the sticks, using the crafting table, you can make um, a pickaxe or a shovel. But well, I need I need a pickaxe, and then I also need a shovel. So that's a sword, and that's a shovel. So I'll get a shovel. Right, and then you just want to get rid of this of this snow here. And just Done that wrong actually. You'll need uh, you need it one down and then gradually go down like a of stairs. Mm. stairs. That's correct English actually. Um, no. Animals are quite annoying. If they get in your way, I'm better to kill them because you can really get in your way after a while. Um, no. 
get lower so that's how you want to start it and then you'll get a crafting bench you might want to move that so if I just get a crafting bench just here and I'm going to move this to about here and then you probably want something to go around here so it doesn't really matter it's just to protect you in case of um, uh, monsters or whatever come so to make a door door's pretty simple I need some more wooden planks to make a door so just get a few of them um, yeah, so to make a door you'll need to make that kind of shape. <coughs> and I'm gonna put the door just here. It doesn't matter where you put the door, but I'm gonna put it here. And then I'm gonna I think I'm just gonna use um, dirt because it doesn't really matter, it's just to protect it from um, any monsters, etc. that try and come in. So excuse me. Perfect. Um, so I'm going to collect some more dirt from here. I just made the stairs. But when you get to a certain point, which will probably be in a minute, as you can see here, you start reaching cobblestone. And cobblestone is also quite helpful um, to make various amount of stuff, really. Um, mainly just um, uh, well, the most important thing is furnaces to make out of them because furnaces then like a crafting table you can make loads of stuff so I'm just gonna make sure this is um, to my like okay and then I'm gonna come back up here and use my dirt just to sort it out you can get mods and cheats that kind of skip night when the monsters come out but that's not kind of what I want to do because it's it's cheating and it doesn't you can't experience the game like you're supposed to, if that makes sense. Right, so I'm not gonna bother with a roof, but if you want to put a roof or something you can. I might do that when I get glass. So it's just something to protect me from protect me from uh, monsters, etc. So I'm gonna dig a bit further down, see if I've already found coal. So coal's used to make uh, torches when it gets dark and you, you're enclosed and you want to get some light. Um, so torches are quite helpful. Um, so you can see, once you find one coal, you see you find loads of it. So it's, if you do find coal like I have here, you'll probably want to dig as, get as much as you can, especially in the early stages, because it's vital then. Um, and also, if you've got coal, it's useless without a furnace, so you'll need a furnace with it as well. So I'm just gonna. I've only got a wooden pickaxe now, so I'm gonna, if you get, if you use different materials such as um, such as cobblestone, you can you can make stronger ones that last and go faster. And so, to make a furnace, it's just a shape of like this. And then the furnace you can just place down next to your workbench, and then put the coal at the bottom, and then put a few sticks at the top. No, that's not right. You, actually, you don't use a furnace to make sticks. Um, there we go. That'll do for now. Eight torches. But what I tend to do is, if I get a furnace, keep coal at the bottom. So then, instead of looking for coal all the time, you know it's. It's a matter of it's just there, so you put whatever you want at the top. Um, so yeah. So what we do with this one now is we go, we stay down here, and um, <coughs> um, yeah, we just get some more coal because this is really useful. watching this YouTube video please do rate comment subscribe or whatever you usually do 
and um, this video was dedicated, de dedicated, dedicated to my friend Darren, Darren Carl. Darren Carl's a great lad, um, and uh, this is a, just a message for Darren. He's in me on desert. Uh, but I promise tonight. Excuse me.